Our hearts are formed by what we worship. Our attitudes, our affections, the things we give our time to, all of our life gets formed by what we worship. Every year on Black Friday, people get up at 5.30 in the morning. Hundreds and hundreds of people get up and they stand in line for hours and hours to get the best deals on stuff. That's a worship event. People are excited to get there and they give themselves to it. And that's a Christmas worship event. I remember hearing of a man who was uh, shot fighting with another man over a PlayStation 3 for his son. That's a love story. It's a weird love story, but it's truly a love story. And his love was expressed in what he worshiped, getting a game for his son. And yet there's this other story, and this really is the story that is the church's to tell. It's the story of Jesus Christ coming into the world to bring salvation and a new humanity to all people. That's a story that isn't told with cheap gifts. It's not a story that is told at malls. It's the church's story. It's our story to tell. And we're not telling it very well. And really the Advent conspiracy is an opportunity and an invitation for us to worship Jesus fully.